Poodles. He has to be with me. I got a shovel. I do. What an unusually bright yellow they are. Yellow pet. It's a striking yellow color. I've already got one. I think strolling through the forest picking flowers is very good practice for being a pirate. Creepy. Creepy. I can't pick that up. Digmaster, the only shovel for serious treasure hunting enthusiasts. That doesn't seem to work. plant. I can't pick that up. I'll never get out of here. The legendary lost treasure of Melee Island. This carefully reproduced piece of Melee Island history has delighted thousands of would-be pirates and their families for generations. Remember, there are other pirates on this island. So go easy on the treasure. Leave some for the next person. Here lies treasure of such unimaginable wealth. Well, you'll just have to dig it up to believe it. Paid for by the Melee Island Chamber of Commerce. 
Digmaster, the only shovel for serious treasure hunting enthusiasts. Well, this shouldn't take too long. Hours pass. <laughs> Hey, I think I hit something. Oh boy. It's a t-shirt. Not my size, but a nice one nonetheless. Well, I guess I should put all this dirt back now. More hours pass. I found the treasure of Melee Island, and all I got was this stupid t-shirt. That doesn't seem to work. Can we get out of here? Okay. What about the stinking part? Whatever you wantin', you scurvy lover. Ever notice how all these roads start to look the same? Yeah. Now that you mention it, they do. That's probably just that we're tired. Nice night we're having, isn't it? I sure hopes you had some more important to stop me for. Sorry to bother you. I'll uh, be on my way. We got a t-shirt. I need to figure out how to get a fish. Some sort of meat or meat like substance. Ow! Got it. It's some sort of meat, or meat-like substance. I don't see anything special about it. I think that bird will peck my hand off. I got a shirt, but I doubt it's for the bird. Oh, it doesn't fit. Figures. doesn't seem to open. It's some sort of meat or meat-like substance. I combine the flour with it. Now I should give it to the dogs. How do I move this shit? I found the treasure of Melee Island, and all I got was this stupid t-shirt.
That doesn't seem to work. What do I got? I think it's a herring. Herring, red herring. I think it's a herring. Can I put it in? Hmm, stewed fish. Hmm, stewed fish. the treasure of Melee Island and all I got was this stupid t-shirt. Oh, it doesn't fit. Figures. I believe that's it over here. Let's go. Let's go to the troll. And then I'll go to the poodles. previously owned vessels. Spiffy. Welcome to Stan's previously owned vessels. I'm off searching the globe right now for the finest in previously owned marine transportation. Have a look around. I'll be right back. Stan. local currency. I have 204 pieces of eight. I have 204 pieces of eight. Huh. Nothing. You can three pieces of eight. Damn it. There must be a more honest way to get some spare change. I have 203 pieces of eight. I'm not stupid enough to do that twice.
find my way around the dock without using that. I can't pick that up. upper ah a fixer upper looks like one of those well-engineered imports I'm surprised this one is still afloat dull 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 There's nothing here. Dude, I hope so. Captain Smirk's big body pirate gym. Prices. Sword training, 30 pieces of weight. Cannon firing, 160 pieces of weight. Falls extra. Grappling hook, 130 pieces of weight. Hook extra. Well, I think I'll knock. It'd only be polite. What do you want, you wimpy little spineless maggot? Can we step inside? It's a little chilly out here. What did you say? I said it's a little chilly out here. Huh. You're right. I could catch a cold. <laughs> What do you want? Um, could you please put out that cigar? It's not good for your health and it smells terrible. Sure, I'd love to put it out. In your face. Uh, maybe I'll just leave instead. Good idea. What do you want? Do you know where the Swordmaster lives? Forget it, kid. She cut your head clean off. Unless, of course, you got some training first. Could you train me to be better than the Swordmaster? Better than the Swordmaster? You? <laughs> you could never be half the sword fighter Carly is. Even with hours of hard work and sweat and blood. I remember fighting side by side with Carla at Port Royal. The local constabulary had us cornered. It looked like we were done for, but then she said... But I digress. You just don't have what it takes. I do so have what it takes. You do not. I do so. You do not. I do so. Oh, I like your spirit. I'll do what I can. Of course, it'll cost you. What do you got? Oh, I am is a dead sheep. Well, I've got 30 pieces of eight. Say no more, say no more. Let's see your sword. Uh, 
Okay, check it out. Yes, this is a nice one. Let's get to it. Okay, you maggot. Why don't you whip that sword out and let's see what you can do with it. Boy, you fight like a dairy farmer. I usually don't waste my time with vermin like yourself. But seeing as this LeChuck thing has put a cramp on business, I got no choice. I need the money. Yes, I can see this is going to take some special measures. Just want you to know, I don't do this with everyone. It's only because I feel that special student mentor pieces of eight bonding that I'm going to these lengths. I'm going to put you up against the machine. The machine? Is this going to hurt? Yikes. Come at me. Don't be afraid. You won't hurt me. Advance, thrust, recover, parry, repulse. Watch your footwork. No! Beat first, then lunge. No! Beat first, then lunge. Watch your footwork. Hours later. You're starting to get the hang of it. More hours later. Not bad. You've got good form. Now I'm going to let you in on the true secret of sword fighting. Sword fighting is kind of like making love. It's not always what you do, but what you say. Any fool pirate can swing a sharp piece of metal around and hope to cut something. But the pros, they know just when to cut their opponent with an insult. One that catches them off guard. You see, kid, your wit's got to be twice as sharp as your sword. Let's try a couple of insults out, shall we? Okay. Imagine this. We're fighting up a storm. Just like Carla and I were doing at Port Royal. There's a sudden break in the fighting, and I say to you, you fight like a dairy farmer. You respond with? So is your mother. So is your mother. I can see we've got a lot of work to do here. You should have responded with something like, How appropriate. You fight like a cow. You see, that wasn't available. It's razor sharp wit like that that wins fights. Let's try another. Imagine this you're trapped up against a wall. My sword just slashed two cuts into your face. I say. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. <laughs> like a shish kebab. You respond with? <laughs> How appropriate. You fight like a cow. No, no, no. That was the response from the last insult. Doesn't even make sense when used here. Ah. Oh. A correct response to... Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. Would have been something like... First, you better stop waving it around like a feather duster. See? Razor sharp. Now, I suggest you go out there and learn some insults. I can't help but feel like I've been ripped off. I'm sure you're feeling something similar. Learn the insults. There's no answer. Great. Ugly pirate, stinking pirate. Ah, I'm supposed to learn from them. Anything on a bridge? Troll is not here anymore. Okay, I think it's with the pirates, should be. Let's go with stinking. Hey, this better be important. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die.
You fight like a dairy farmer. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. You make me want to puke. I am rubber, you are glue. There are no words for how disgusting you are. Oh, yeah? I give up, you win. Jesus Christ, now I need to do it with way, everyone. Or I cut my way through. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. There are no words for how disgusting you are. Yes, there are. You just never lined them. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. Oh, yeah? I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. Oh, yeah? It has to be done like this, until you learn all the insults. Move out of the way, or I cut my way through. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. I'm glad to hear you attended your family reunion. You make me want to puke. Oh, yeah? Ah, okay, we'll answer. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. First, you'd better stop waiting it like a feather duster. You make me want to puke. Oh, I am rubber, you are glue. I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. Where did my sword go? More. Or I cut my way through. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. I'm glad to hear you attended your family reunion. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. Oosh, that's a new one. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. There are no words for how disgusting you are.
Yes, there are. You just never learned them. Boy, are you ugly. I'm insulted you'd even try to use that insult on me. Are you up? You win? Yeah, you got quite a lot now. What you be wanting, you scurvy lubber? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. What an idiot. What an amateur insult! Me handkerchief will wipe up your blood. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. Mm, okay, that's one. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Uncle, uncle. Stopping a pirate can be dangerous to your health. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. Oh, I am rubber, you are glue. Ah, fuck, he doesn't know the answer. I need the answer. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. Oh, I'm shaken. Oh, he doesn't I'm know the shaken. answer. You call yourself a pirate? Ah, is that the best you can come up with? I've spoken with apes more polite I, than you. I need the answer for that. I'm glad to hear you attended your family reunion. Boy, give up. Okay. You. Till I learn those answers. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, come on, troll. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. So, you got that job as janitor, after all. We got the answer. You have the manners of a beggar. But so you won. Oh, yeah? I'm not gonna take your insolence sitting down. That's a new one, oh, Bill. Oh, yeah? Uncle, uncle? That's a lot of insults, man. Hey, this better be important. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. You have the manners of a beggar. Oh, yeah? Fuck, he doesn't know. I'm 
I'm not gonna take your insolence sitting down. Your hemorrhoids are flaring up again, eh? People fall at my feet when they see me coming. I don't know that one. Oh, yeah? Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. First, you'd better stop waiting it like a feather duster. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. I'm shaking, I'm shaking. I give up, you win. Whatever you want, you scurvy lover. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. I don't know how many insults there are. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Oh, yeah. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. He must have taught you everything you know. That's a new one. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. That a new one. Oh, yeah? First, you finish I with all Monkey Islands, then I'll play Return, yeah? What did he say I didn't hear? Oh, yeah? I give up! You win! Move out of the way, or I cut my way through! My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die! People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Even before they smell your breath? People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Even before they smell your breath? Nobody's ever drawn blood from me and nobody ever will. I'm shaking, I'm shaking! He doesn't know. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. I am rubber. You are glue. Wow. You're good enough to fight the Swordmaster. Am I? I doubt it. I think I need more. Dangerous to your elf. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. I'm shaking, I'm shaking. They don't know. You're the answer. There are no words for how disgusting you are. Oh, yeah? You have the manners of a beggar. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. Even before they smell your breath? I won't show the dog that was smarter than you. He 
must have taught you everything you know. Wow! You're good enough to fight the sword, master. Not good enough, I still need two more answers. Move out of the way or I cut my way through. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. I played it 25 years ago. But this is... What, what is this? Special edition? Like a remaster? I can't remember much from 25 years ago, to be honest. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. Oh, I'm shaken. Oh, I'm shaken. I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. Oh, I am rubber, you are glue. You fight like a dairy farmer. Oh, yeah. Jesus Christ, not a single answer. Wow, you're good enough to. Okay, if I'm good enough, but I think I need more. Is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Even before they smell your breath? I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. He must have taught you everything you know. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. You run that fast. That's a new answer. Nice. Okay. You have the manners of a beggar. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. I'm shaking, I'm shaking! Wow, you're good enough to fight the Swordmaster! Move out of the way, or I cut me way through! My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Okay, that's it. I give up. You win. That's it. I think I got them all. Now, let's go to those poodles. I think it's gonna work this time. Let's see. Eighteen percent done.
I did everything here, yeah. Poodles. Thank God it fucking works. Important notice. These dogs are not dead. They are only sleeping. No animals were harmed during the production of this game. <laughs> what? Fucking funny as hell. They're sleeping peacefully. Piranha poodles. A priceless Ming. I got a priceless Ming. And what I do with you? It doesn't seem to open. I don't recognize the man, but that looks like the dog in the bar. No time for reading now. This door appears to be locked. <laughs> I don't recognize the man, but that looks like the dog in the bar. I don't recognize the man, but that looks like the dog in the bar. I can't move it. I can't move it. It doesn't seem to open. That doesn't seem to work. Slash master, when you want a sword as sharp as your wit. That doesn't seem to work. I found the treasure of Melee Island and all I got was this stupid t-shirt. See what's here. This looks like a job for Fester Shine Top. I better leave this here. No, not the red button. It's a big, ugly, hairy yak wearing some wax lips. I can't move it. I can't move it. I'm not touching the thing. Is it a bug? It has to be a bug. I can already tell it's a bug. Holy shit, man. I think the vase caused that.
Important notice. Yo, in immediate. This looks like a job for Fester Shine Top. Now you picked up the rays. No, not the red button. It's a big, ugly, hairy yak wearing some wax lips. I can't move it. I can't move it. I, I, I don't get it. Is it a bug? What a fuck. I'll need this. I must be nuts. Fuck! <laughs> Gophers! It's beautiful. Fabulous idol. I can't open it. Uh oh. Pick up Harry Jack. <laughs> you was Harry Jack with shit. That should hold him for a while. If only I had a file, I could get the idol. What file? I locked the sheriff in there. Mm -hmm. No time for reading now. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. I don't see anything special about it. I still don't have a file. File. What fucking file and what am I supposed what what do you got? Gopher repellent. It says gophers won't come near you with this stuff on. Uh-huh. Okay, that's for the prison, I guess. Wax lips. They're yak sized and covered with slobber. I'm certainly not gonna chew on them. Manual of style. I think it's some kind of religious text. Staple reward. I bet this will come in handy. Let's try to. No staples to be removed. I bet this will come in handy. I bet this will come in handy. No staples to be removed. I need to test now. No staples to be removed. They're yak-sized and covered with slobber. I'm certainly not going to chew on them. It doesn't seem to open. It doesn't seem to open. Oh my god. What do you mix with what here? I'm running out of ideas. doesn't seem to work. No staples to be removed.
That doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. It's locked! I don't think that'll open it. It's locked! It's locked! doesn't fit. Figures. Hey, this might work on the rats. Thanks. Here's the cake. The cake. It's heavy. Heavy. Heels. Is this? It's a raspy metal file. Metal file. Look, I like visitors and everything, but I don't have much more to say. Plus, my throat's getting dry from all this talking. Why don't you go find someone else to talk to? It's not like I'm the only pirate left on the island or anything. That pile is for the house. Is it? He said I need a file. I got so many items right now. I don't see anything special about it. I've got the file. Mm-hmm. Manual of style with Shredder. Whee! The fellow is going to heavily armored plow. Throw wax slips in fire. Use file. Use file and lock. Pick up Fabulous Idol. <laughs> that was a close one. At least I got the idol. But I'm not done with you yet. Uh oh. Thought you could get out of here with the idol of many hands, did you? Look, I can explain. So can I. You poisoned the governor's pet poodles. They're just sleeping. <laughs> Broke into her house. The door was unlocked. And stole one of her most valuable pieces of art. No, you've got it all wrong. Oh, really? Well, let's hear your explanation. It belongs in the museum. She said I could have it. Ta! Ah! What's going on here? I caught this hoodlum making off with your idol, Governor. He says you gave it to him. That's right, I did. What? You heard me, Fester. The real question is, how did he get in here while you were on guard? I, uh... Oh, just go away, Fester. I can handle this. Hmm. I'll deal with you later. Sorry about him. He's new. I'm Governor Marley. Governor Elaine Marley. So, I gave you the idol, eh? Gee. <laughs> Relax, Mr. Threepwood. I know why you're here. Believe me, you're not the first who's tried. Although I have to admit, not many get as far as you have. Um... 
My lookout told me of your arrival. I wanted to meet you ever since I heard your fascinating name. Tell me, Guybrush, why do you want to be a pirate? We don't look like one. Your face is too... sweet. <laughs> Girl. I see. Well, you're obviously not in the mood for idle chit-chat, are you? I suppose you've got many more exciting things to do? I won't take up any more of your time, Mr. Threepwood. Boo! <laughs> And <laughs> Wrinkly? <sighs> I really wish I knew how to talk to women. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. <clears throat> what we got? What we got? Fabulous side. It's beautiful. It doesn't seem to open. It doesn't seem to open. I lost so many items at the same time, was staple remover. Oh man, what now? I need a sword fight, sword master. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. Look at the broken window. I better be careful not to cut myself. I better be careful not to cut myself. I guess that's all I can do right now. Where oh do you think God. you're going, Throom Wade? Buzz off, Fester. I think you need to cool off. Hand over your sword. No, not a sword. Uh -oh. This is the end of the road, my little pantalooned pal. Your troublemaking days on Melee Island are over. My plans for the governor are far too important and much too near completion to risk letting a would-be pirate like you get in the way. So long, Mr. Spice Cake or Droop Face or whatever your name is. <laughs> With the idol. Mm, this might actually turn out to be a pretty good day. I, I, he can breathe underwater for 10 minutes. Uh, I need to get out. Sharp and dangerous. Very sharp. Heavy and sharp. It's sharp. I better be careful. I can't reach that from here. Actually, it's more like a fabulous doorstop. I guess I'll be needing a sword. This one will do. Well, that wasn't so hard. Now all I have to do is show this stupid idol to the pirate leaders and... You're alive! Governor! Hey! You can talk. Huh, who'd have known? What are you doing here? Come to finish the job? No, I came down here to save your life. Fester wasn't acting on my orders when he threw you in there. Uh, you came down here to rescue me? I, I didn't even think you liked me. Well, our first meeting was a little awkward. You seemed to have trouble forming complete sentences. But then again, so do most of my citizens. But I'm not one of your citizens. I'm just a drifter. A nobody. A would-be pirate. Who would have known or even cared if you'd let me drown? I would have, Guybrush. Oh, Governor. Oh, Threepwood. 
Oh, Elaine. Oh, Guybrush. <laughs> Love Muffin. Love Muffin. Sugar Boots. <laughs> Honey Pumpkin. Plunder Bunny. Kiss me. No, we mustn't. What? Not here, where everyone can see us. Why, are you ashamed of me? No, no, it's not that at all. It's just that many of these pirates have made advances towards me. And to avoid hurting their feelings, I've always told them that my father made me promise never to fall in love with a pirate. If they see us together, they'll know I was lying. Okay then, let's go to your place. Okay. But finish your trials first. I don't want you to be preoccupied. But I feel this sudden urge to complete the trials <laughs> with me. Twenty two percent done. What I do, what I do now. I need a sword master. The only guy that knows where the sword master is is the storekeeper. across the island to try and get you a reservation with the Swordmaster, who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake, and when I come back, whew, you're gone. See if I ever do you a favor again. What do you want? I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Maybe if you asked her again? Hmm... I guess I could hike all the way over there... again. Be right back. And don't touch anything! I need to figure this shit out also. Let's save. sets when it does that when it goes up it resets can I pull the words it's push
Davy Jones Lockers, the last word in theft, fire, and grog-resistant storage devices. That's for the treasure, I already got it. Davy Jones lockers, the last word in theft, fire, and grog-resistant storage devices. I do not have a fucking clue. That has to be the right order. I feel like it.
Davy Jones Lockers, the last word in theft, fire, and grog-resistant storage devices. Davy Jones Lockers, the last word in theft, fire, and grog-resistant storage devices. Davy Jones Lockers, the last word in theft, fire, and grog-resistant storage devices. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. I both combinations, it doesn't work.
I don't know. I don't know. I tried. I tried everything. Now if you try and find a sword master. Safe is probably extremely important to continue, so I'll need to figure something out. But I tried everything, goddammit. Did I like this call? This call is freaking great. One of the of the best adventures I played. People call it CRPG. It's not a CRPG. It's an adventure. Isometric adventure, but still an adventure. Move out of the way, or I. My way I think I got a review for it on my channel. Sorry to bother you. I'll uh, be on my way. For this go. Where is that tedious? It's getting rough now. It's really getting rough now. I only got one out of three quests. That safe is annoying. I don't see anything special about it. Where'd you go? I hike halfway across the island to try and get you a reservation with the halfway sword master. across the island. Who, by the mm -hmm. way, says you can go jump in the go immediate. And when I come back, whew, you're gone. See if I ever do you a favor again. What do you want? Fucking follow it. I'm looking for the sword master of Melee Island. Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Maybe if you asked her again? Hmm, I guess I could hike all the way over there again. Be right back. Come on. And don't touch anything! Yeah, come on. There he is. There's the fucker. Got him, got him. <laughs> Man, you fuck him first. you it can't be the fork <laughs> fucking reset it what on earth man now you fucking annoy me. Maybe I was way too fast. Maybe I should slow it down a bit. 
I never did a disco review, really. Weird. It's a brilliant game, in short. Can't believe I didn't do a review about this go. Brilliant game, okay. Nearly 10 out of 10 adventure. Extremely unique game. <laughs> you go i hike halfway across the island to try and get you a reservation with the sword master who by the way says you can go jump in the lake and when i come back whew, you're gone see if i ever do you a favor again what do you want i'm looking for the sword master of melee island look i told you she doesn't want to see you maybe if you asked her again Hmm, I guess I could hike all the way over there again. Be right back. And don't touch anything! He's in a pork. <laughs> Mel fucked up puzzles are. Holy shit. The sword master. I better just stay back here and eavesdrop. Hello again, Carla. I thought I told you to get lost. Actually, I'm here on the uh, business. This kid come into my store, see? Face it, you crusty old lech. You'd make any excuse just to come out here and bother me. Yeah, I guess so. Well, cut it out. I'm sick of it. Take a hike and don't come out here again. Someone might follow you, and then I'd become another Melee Island tourist attraction. Hey, it's your loss, baby. Yeah, right. Now scram! How dare you approach the Swordmaster without permission, which I surely didn't give you. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. I've come to kill you. Nothing like being honest. I can tell by the sarcastic expression on your face that you've been fully trained by Captain Smirk. Let's get this over with. I will milk every drop of blood from your body. I don't have that one. Your hemorrhoids are flaring up again, eh? I don't have that one. 
My last fight ended with my hands covered with blood. Your hemorrhoids are flaring up again, huh? One, one. I've got the courage and skill of a master swordsman. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. I hope you have a boat ready for a quick escape. Jesus Christ, what are these? God damn it. So you got that job as a janitor after all. Disgusting. I don't have answers for this. No one will ever catch me fighting as badly as you do. What? How appropriate. You fight like a cow. My tongue is sharper than any sword. Man, are you shitting me? Oh, yeah? I got no answer Uncle, for this. Uncle! Uncle! <laughs> I hope this teaches you a lesson. Now scram. Should have saved. It was the last out to save. Holy shit, it was a long time ago. When will I be there? God damn it. Uh, I don't have those answers. That's bullshit. My, what an unusually bright yellow they are. I've already got one. We used it, you moron. See if it's available again. If not, the oh fuck. <laughs> I'm back, and boy, are you in trouble this time. Let's get this over with. Now I know what filth and stupidity really are. What, what are these? What the fuck? Oh, yeah? My sword is famous all over the Caribbean. What? Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. I usually see people like you passed out on tavern floors.
I'm glad to hear you attended your family reunion. No one will ever catch me fighting as badly as you do. You run that fast? You are a pain in the backside, sir. Your hemorrhoids are flaring up again, huh? My last fight ended with my hands covered with blood. So you got that job as a janitor after all. I hope you have a boat ready for a quick escape. Run that fast? I've got the courage and skill of a master swordsman. First, you'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. There are no clever moves that can help you now. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. Look behind you, a three-headed monkey. <laughs> I hope this teaches you a lesson. Now scram. I was on point three times, but uh, it seems like I don't have all answers. I'm back, and boy, are you in trouble this time. Let's get this over with. My last fight ended with my hands covered with blood. Your hemorrhoids are flaring up again, huh? My wisest enemies run away at the first sight of me. Even before they smell your breath? Now I know what filth and stupidity really are. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. My tongue is sharper than any sword. First, you'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. Every word you say to me is stupid. Ah, 
I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. My sword is famous all over the Caribbean. Nice. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. I give up. You win. Nice. Well, I hope you're happy. You can go back and brag to all your friends about how you beat the sword master. You'll need proof. Here, this should convince them. The treasure? Be the sword master? And get the idol. I got all three. I think. We can go back. Now we're gonna see what's next. Winston Little Big Adventure. I can't remember. I need to check the game out. Ooh, I done the fish like an hour ago. But this was disgusting with the uh, sword play. Lechuk. What was that? I'm so confused. Hey, what are you doing just standing around? The governor's been kidnapped. What? By whom? Lechuk's got her on that ship that just sailed off. Well, I'm afraid we've seen the last of her. So where were you this whole time? Sleeping? Hey, I'm a lookout, not a bodyguard. Where did they go? Lechuk's taken the governor back to his hideout on Monkey Island. I'm afraid that no pirate on this island is brave enough to follow him there. But hey, good luck. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Uh, they left this note. You can have it, but I don't think you'll like what it says. Attention, pirates of melee. Your governor is alive and well and by my side as she was always meant to be. If you try to find us, you will only meet with horrifying disaster. Yours truly, Captain LeChuck. Well, yo. We need a crew now and the ship. No one's gone by. <laughs> Looks like a fine pewter tanker. Looks like a fine pewter tanker. <laughs> Looks like a fine pewter tanker. <laughs> <laughs> Three. <laughs> Looks like a fine pewter tankard. <laughs> What's wrong, old son? The governor is gone. LeChuck and his spectral crew came and got her. They put her in the ghost ship and spirited her away. She was so good to me. Always conveniently losing those health board reports. For a small consideration, of course. What'll become of my business? Oh, woe is me. What can I do to save her? <laughs> you must get a ship and go after her. The ghost pirate's lair is on Monkey Island. Everybody knows that. Don't ask me how. All you need to do is find a way there. Where can I get a ship? Why, it's Smiling Stan's used shipyard. 
Same as everybody else. Tell them I sent you. We're old friends. Will you join me? Uh, alas, I cannot go to see an old war injury. I'm sure you understand. Get me a drink. Get your own drink. Right. I'm off. Good luck. Be sure to wear your mittens. And your galoshes. And don't forget to write. Bye now. <laughs> ah. What are those cups? Looks like a fine pewter tankard. This stuff is eating right through the mug. Eating right through a look at melting mug. Looks like a fine pewter tankard. Looks like a fine pewter tankard. Eating jail. And the lock. I need two. Do I? Looks like a fine pewter tankard. I think I have enough already. Uh -huh. Hmm, stewed meat. Ow! Got it! <laughs> Is it timed? That's why I got five. Oh my god, it's timed. It's fucking timed. That's why five months disappeared. <laughs> no, no fucking way out. Ah, how? It'll melt. I don't see anything special about it. I don't see anything special about it. May I help you? I was just on my way to the governor's mansion. Are you here for the looting? Absolutely not. That's good. Because we are booked up solid for the next five hours. What the fuck? May I help you? I'm here to loot the governor's mansion. And do you have reservations, sir? Why, yes, I do have reservations. And what name would they be under? Uh, 
It's probably under S for Shine Top. Nice try, but we're booked solid for the next five hours. Mm, but I might be able to squeeze you in around the two o'clock hour. Would that be okay? Yes, that would be fine. Super. I'll put you down for one to loot the governor's mansion at 2.30. Employees only. Employees only. Oh, a circus! I love a circus! I'm running out of ideas. Hey, Let's see. where'd you go? I hike halfway across the island to try and get you a reservation with the Swordmaster, who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake. And when I come back, whew, you're gone. See if I ever do you a favor again. What do you want? I think I'd just like to browse. Hey, this ain't no boutique. Don't take all day. That's not fucking safe. Hey, I'm back and I'm ready to know more about the future. <laughs> so, you have returned to learn future. Yes, I must go after the governor. You must first find others to help in your cause. I really hate that flashing. It makes me see spots. Quiet. I am getting another vision. You must... Must what? You must go to Monkey Island. Once there, you will search for the ghost pirate, LeChuck. He hides deep, deep beneath Monkey Island. There is only one thing powerful enough to destroy LeChuck. What? It's an ancient root. Once prepared, the root can destroy a ghost with one touch. Yeah! I'm getting more. More vision. Spill it! I see the cannibals that live on the island. They are helping you or eating you. I can't tell. The vision isn't coming in clear anymore. Great. Now go and find the one that loves you. But be warned. Don't worry. I'll watch out for LeChuck. Not of LeChuck, of yourself. What you will find out about yourself and your world, it will terrify you. Mm. Did you know the governor's been kidnapped? Yes, we knew about that. Can I interest you in a dream vacation to Monkey Island? Because of this sudden change in local government, I'm prepared to offer you a once-in-a-lifetime price on a cruise to that scenic wonderland, Monkey Island. And the amazing thing about this offer is the price. Absolutely free. All you have to do is help me crew the ship and Island Paradise can be yours. Free. 
And we might just rescue the governor while we're at it. Uh... Well... The governor could probably take care of herself. And we are sort of busy here. Yeah... And we've got the circus to think of. We've got to find the elephant. Find the rat. Yeah! And get rid of these minutes! I'm sorry. We simply can't go at this time. Excuse me, but do... Now it's only you again. I told you there was only one in existence. Now get lost. Where's the old? There is this with a mug I can reach on time. This for the luck. I'll save you, Elaine. I promise. We need a ship. And a crew. of Stan's previously owned vessels, and I'd stand on my head to make you a deal. What sort of craft are you looking for? Big, fast, slow. You want it, I got it. And if I don't got it, I'll get it. I wanna make you a deal that you're happy with. Because if you're not happy, I'm not happy. But I know you're gonna leave here happy today. How do I know? Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, take a look around. So tell me, <laughs> you what are you economy. interested in looking at today? The best you got. Let me see the best ship you've got. Hey, it's nice to meet a man who appreciates quality. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. Now this, this is a ship fit for a king. I mean, we're talking 15 staterooms, a fireplace in every one. We're talking two pools, one indoor, one outdoor. We're talking rotating ballroom. We're talking heated crow's nest. We're talking 200 feet of ocean going decadence. And all for one low price. Speaking of price, let's talk about money. Your money. I was hoping to get one of the credit. No more than 173 pieces of eight. I have 371 pieces of eight. I think we must be talking about completely different ships here. You've obviously been out of the ship market for quite some time. I doubt you're carrying enough cash on you for this transaction. You wouldn't happen to have any other means of finance, would you? And the rubber chicken. All I have is this rubber chicken. Is it one of those rubber chickens with a pulley in the middle? I already got one of those. You wouldn't happen to have any other means of finance, would you? Money is no object. Well, it is with me. How much you got? Actually, I was hoping to get one on credit. Sorry, kid. Neither a borrower nor a lender be. That's just old Stan's philosophy. If you've got a job, the storekeeper in town might extend you some credit. Then we'd have something to talk about. Unless, of course, you've already got some other means of financing. 
On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Okay, but I got five of the guys coming back to look at this baby today. Don't count on it being here if you change your mind. So, what else can I show you? Something not too expensive, but built to last. Affordable quality. Hey, that's my motto. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. Now I can see you're a no frills kind of guy, but I can also tell that quality means a lot to you. I mean, just look at the way you dress. Rugged, like this baby. She comes from a land far to the north where the sea is as unforgiving as the men are tough and hey, you wouldn't happen to be from there, would you? You just seem to have a sort of Nordic quality about you. Anyway, we're talking about a real value here. Just how much were you looking to spend today? I have 371 pieces of eight. I'm glad this ship doesn't have ears, my friend. Because if she did, she'd slap your face. I don't think you've got the cash for this transaction either. You do have some other means of payment, don't you? On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Okay, but I got five of the guys coming back to look at this baby today. Don't count on it being here if you change your mind. So, what else can I show you? That spiffy blue one by your office looks nice. Of course it does. It's mine. And it's not for sale. What else can I show you? I don't really have that much to spend. Have no fear. Every, Every ship I sell is a bargain. But if you're looking for a real steal, I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. There he is. This here is no. the famous sea monkey. sea monkey. The only ship ever to make it to Monkey Island and come back with anyone aboard left alive. Or should I say, anything. You see, the previous owners of this ship were two adventurous pirates. They set off, like many before, to find the legendary secret of Monkey Island. And like many before, they disappeared forever. Their fate? A mystery. Almost as mysterious as how this ship returned to Melee Island without a single human aboard. Some claim it was sailed back by a crew of chimps. Chimps? There aren't any chimps in the Caribbean. Oh, shut up. It makes a good story. Anyway, this baby's mine now. That is, until someone makes me an offer. Let's talk about money. Your money. I have 371 pieces of eight. Look, this is a very reasonably priced ship, but not that reasonable. I don't think you've got the cash for this transaction either. You do have some other means of payment, don't you? On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Okay, but I tell you, I now. got a feeling you're going to leave here today with a new previously owned vessel. So, what else can I show you? Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Sure, sure, think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. Bye now. 